our job is to not tamper with the food that is um, arguably the, the best food available. into dairy farming with my family was uh, really a lifestyle that that allowed us to be together I need milk for my coffee though making bad coffee tastes good we're ready to start milking. These are our two New Jersey cows from an Organic Valley dairy farm. And so they're used to being milked earlier in the morning. We're a little bit uh, lazy. We, la we milk later on in the day. So it's 7.30, we're ready to start. And then we'll milk again at 7.30 in the evening. Girls. Here comes Daisy. Hey, Daisy. Hey, A small dairy like ours allows us to be really in touch with our cows and to be close with them. Um, unlike larger dairies where the herd size is is much larger and there's less um, opportunity to spend time with the cows and really get to know them. Um, for us, we're, we're quite close to the cows because we're so small. Yeah, there's days when your body doesn't want to get out of bed. <laughs> there's days when uh, you don't want to go out into the cold and, and bear the elements and, and, and certainly the because we're a family farm, my kids have to experience that and go through that as well. I guess a lot of kids don't really know how to do hard work, so when they come here they see that um, life is work and just give it your all when it comes to work and do it well. Well, you kind of have to be disciplined and not complain. You kind of have to just deal with it because you have to milk them twice a day and that kind of gets annoying. Yeah, there's a there's much more of an attachment to the reality of life when you farm. And I'm a Central Oregon native. I grew up here and grew up in farming communities. I wasn't handed a farm by my by my parents or you know those that went before me, and so uh, we've basically had to scrape and uh, put together what we could. To, uh, to start out this life. This farm is very much uh, a work in progress and uh, yeah, definitely much like uh, myself and my family. We are, you know, working along to get this place to a point where, where people can come and visit and take part in this life. Most people don't know where their food's coming from. And so there's a, there's a range of people that want to know where that their food is coming from and so we're trying to help them with that. At least have a farm that they can visit and be connected to the reality of, of farm life.
There's times when, uh, honestly, you know, you're just barely scraping by, just barely making it. But that's all, you know, that's all worth it um, for the life.